Hello, my name is Wacław Gudowski. I am professor of neutron and reactor physics at KTH. And I'm also a program director of the master program in nuclear energy engineering. I would like to present for you a course on geological storage of spent nuclear fuel, which I coordinate. I am only one of many, many competent lecturers there. As you can see, we go half a kilometer under the ground at Espo Hard Rock Laboratory during this course to investigate the geological storage of spent fuel and what are the physical and chemical conditions for that. Why to choose this course? Well, this course is a unique opportunity for students, experts and professors alike work together on fundamentals of the back end of the nuclear fuel cycle and nuclear spent fuel management. There is no future for nuclear power if there is no technically feasible and socially acceptable solutions for the nuclear spent fuel and nuclear waste management. And geological storage, as in the Swedish model, is one of the interesting options. Sweden is really a world leader in this field. And Oskarsham is a test bed for the Swedish model. Oskarsham, it is a beautiful town in South Archipelago, Shergord in Swedish, with most probably one of the most beautiful nuclear power plant location in the world. Here is Oskarsham reactor. Few words about the course content. In this course, you will learn about nuclear fuel cycles and their back ends, radiotoxicity of nuclear spent fuel, radioactive waste type, the interim and the final storage of spent nuclear fuel, petrology and mineralogy, plate tectonics, metamorphism, quaternary geology, hydrogeology and hydrogeochemistry, so-called KBS method, you will learn what is KBS also, and last but not least, the social aspect of storing of nuclear waste. This is a part of the um, subject which we are spending quite a lot of time on. The organizers of the course, they are key cooperating university, KTH and the Linnaeus University, together with Nova Center for University Studies, Research and Development in Oskarsham, and Swedish Nuclear Fuel and Waste Management Company, SKB, in court. Course take place two weeks every June and 30 students can participate. Only 30 because of technical limitation. We have cooperating universities worldwide. We have cooperation with Tsinghua University in Beijing, the Technical University of Warsaw, so-called Politechnika Warszawska, Krakow Technical University, AGH, Akademia Gorniczo-Hutnicza, Illinois University at Urbana-Champagne, Korean Advanced Institute of Science and Technology, University of Houston downtown, and last but not least, Moscow Research um, Institute in Nuclear Physics, MIFI. Lecturers. We have lecturers from the whole world, however, the key lecturers are coming from Oskarsham, from SKB and from the Swedish program of the spent nuclear fuel management. We have here the American lecturers, Chinese lecturer, a very well-known geologist from Kalmar, Tommy Klasson, and then we have a group of the people actually who were working actively on the Swedish model of the geological disposal. I would mention here Jenny Rees, who is uh, an expert on the public communication, and Peter Wigberry, who is actually the research director of SKB. As you also can see, we have a nice mix from the different fields. Field studies at Oskar Shams facilities. We are going to ESPO Hard Rock Laboratory to CLAP. CLAP means interim storage of the spent nuclear fuel. Actually, in this place, there is a stored 
uh, spent fuel from the whole Swedish nuclear power program. And then last but not least, we go to canister laboratory, so-called CLAP, workshop to manufacture spent fuel canister. This is on the ground. CLAP is 25 meters under the ground and ESPO, as I mentioned, half kilometer under the ground. Here you have some picture from ESPO laboratory and here is a Swedish canister for the spent nuclear fuel. Well, here you can see a nice video from visiting of the interim storage facility, CLAP. Here you can see the spent fuel actually stored in the water. In ESPO laboratory, Haldro laboratory under the ground, we do not only science and some laboratory exercises, we also experience some music. Here is a good example of the music experience in the ESPO laboratory. As a part of examination process, students prepare a program of the information, informational meetings with the local communities of relevance for a location of the geological storage of spent nuclear fuel. A 10-minute presentation for each group should convince the local community that this is the right place for location of the geological storage. Here you can see actually the very active reporting on their work and here you have some actually headlines which the groups prepared for the reports. You can also realize that that must be a German group, there must be actually the Baltic country group and that is probably the Swedish group preparing. The, so here you have a very active actually reporting on the different aspects of the spent nuclear fuel disposal. Except for the 7.5 7 credits, ECTS credits, students get also special certificate of completion of the course which actually comes into their CV. Here you have an example of the certificate awarding ceremony at the end of the course after making all the examination assignment. We need really to find good solution for nuclear spent fuel in order to make nuclear energy an acceptable and environmental friendly energy source. As you can see, one billion people have no health care due to the energy poverty. And 1.3 billion people have no access to electrical energy. And this is a map which is showing actually the lights of the earth during the night and actually this map corresponds also with the map of the world on the earth. So use of the energy is directly related to the wealth of the people. And whatever we do, we have today over 400 reactors in operation and 71 reactors under construction. So spent nuclear fuel management is a very important and living problem for the whole nuclear technology. If any questions, do not hesitate to contact me, my email address Vaclav at KTHSE, and don't forget, we fly high in our courses. Thank you very much.